Jill Kelly, Ireland, 1860, my dear and loving son John. Your good friend, the schoolmaster, Pat McNamara's so good as to write these words down. Your brothers have all gone to find work in England. The house is so empty and sad. The crop of potatoes sorely infected, a third to a half of them bad. And your sister Bridget and Patrick O'Donnell, they're going to be married in June. Your mommy says not to work on the railway and be sure to come on home soon. Kilkelly, Ireland, eighteen and seventy, dear and loving son John. Hello to your missus, to your four children, I hope they grow healthy and strong. Our Michael has got in a wee bit of trouble, I don't think that he'll ever learn. Because of the dampness, there's no turf to speak of, and there's nothing to burn. But Bridget is happy, you named a child for her, you know she has six of her own. You say you found work, but you don't say what kind, when are you coming home? Kilkelly, Ireland, 18 and 80, dear Michael and John, my sons. I'm sorry to give you the very sad news, your mommy passed on We buried her down at the church in Kilkelly Your brothers and Bridget were there You don't have to worry, she died very quickly Remember her in your prayers And it's good to hear that Michael's returning With money he's sure to buy land For the crop has been poor and the people are selling at any price they can. Give Kelly, I hold in eighteen and ninety, my dear and loving son John. I suppose that I must now be close on to eighty. Thirty years you've been gone Because of all of the money you sent me I'm still living out on my own Our Michael has built himself a fine house Bridget's daughters are grown And thank you for sending your family picture They're lovely young women and men You say that you might even come for a visit what joy to see you again Jill Kelly, I held in 18 and 92 My dear brother John I'm sorry I didn't write sooner to tell you your da passed on He was living with Bridget She said he was cheerful And healthy right up to the end You should have seen him Play with the grandchildren Of Pat McNamara, your friend And we buried him down Alongside Mommy In the Kilkelly churchyard He was a strong and a feisty old man Considering his life was so hard And it's funny the way he kept talking about you He called for you at the end Why don't you come on back home for a visit We'd all love to see you again